Canada, round 7 of the championship. The weather conditions, with quite low temperatures despite the time of the year, means that we have chosen two compounds with a low working range, medium and super soft. This is instead of the combination we took to Canada last year, soft and super soft. Montreal is a semi-permanent track, not used a lot during the year. So, at the start of the weekend, particularly for free practice on Friday, the track is green with very little rubber on the surface. The lack of this layer of rubber, which is laid down on the track during the weekend, increases the possibility of graining. What is this phenomenon? Graining can happen when the tires are first used. It of course when heavy demands are placed on the compounds before they have reached their optimal working temperature. The surface of the compound, which is too cold, doesn't manage to supply the grip requested, so it slides, creating abrasion between the tire and the track surface. Wave-like patterns then form on the tread, increasing wear and degradation. It happens most often on circuits like Montreal, which place big longitudinal stress on the tires. Once it starts, graining is very hard to stop. So it's essential for drivers to manage their tires properly, especially during the first few laps, while the compound is still coming up to temperature.